Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 6th of March 2024. I hope you are feeling well. I hope you're, uh, you are able to exercise and relax and uh, enjoy life as best you can and with uh, low levels of stress. Unlike me, I'm facing lots of stress at the moment, elevated stress levels at the moment, partly from business related activities. And partly because of my uh, sick cat, who is uh, today due to go uh, due to uh, have a hospital appointment, which is going to be painful and dangerous. I've already signed the uh, consent forms, um, but that's going to be really bad for him today. And uh, for, he's already on nil by mouth at the moment, so. He's at the moment he's asleep. But I imagine if you if you suddenly hear meowing sounds, it's he's going to be asking for breakfast. But I can't have to deny him breakfast this morning, as he's on nil by mouth until uh, his uh, procedure later. Um, and uh, it, apparently, it can be dangerous, which is why I've had to sign consent forms. Um, so uh, apart from my life, what's going on in other people's lives? I see, uh, as expected, the Tor according to the Guardian, the Tories are preparing uh, tax cuts to dazzle in the eyes of uh, people who <laughs> believe that tax cuts are what 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 is really needed: smaller government, more ser more cuts to services. Uh, most people in Britain are complaining about the, the incredibly poor level of services everywhere. And uh, the Tories want to make it worse. So if that's what you believe, don't ever complain. If you vote Tory, don't ever complain about the NHS or other services again. Because you've lost the right, I think, if you vote Tory this time. All right, shall we get on with the game of Sudoku? Uh, this is a medium level game from The Guardian, so it shouldn't take too long. Um, I can see some things going on with the nines here. We've got nine blocking across here and nine up here and up here. So that's going to give me nine, excuse me, there, nine like this. And one's across here. Didn't have time yesterday to play any other uh, more difficult games, and today also I'm not sure that I'll be able to. Probably won't be able to play any uh, other level games um, of Sudoku. I just don't have the time. I sus I won't have the time. I suspect uh, today either. <clears throat> we have seven across here, seven down here. There's our seven. Seven down here, seven across there, and seven down here will give me a seven there. Hopefully, uh, normal service will be resumed quite soon. That means we'll be playing like a few games a day. Uh, we'll, we'll, I'm just not sure yet. <laughs> Life is never certain, right? Five blocking across there puts... Five into that square, and five to the end here. Give us five there. I see our five and seven stuck nicely together, so I know that's a pair of five and seven. I don't know if it means anything else, though. <coughs> we don't normally need to do that kind of thing in these. Guardian medium level puzzles. Actually, I don't think it's going to mean much very much at the moment there. Anyway, let's see what else we can do. <coughs> oh, look, we're missing a three. How about that? A medium level and we're missing a three. That's probably unusual. 
I'm not that worried about it, but I'm just saying uh, four blocking down here. There's our four. And now we've got our first three. <laughs> I know it's three because that's the remaining digit. So it has to be three. This is going to be two and eight. So two blocking up here and two across there will give us two in that square. And the six blocking up here puts six there. And we're left in these squares with three and five. So this down here is going to be four. Five blocking this square, but we need a five in this column. So let's put it there and we'll finish with a three. So now it doesn't matter. We've got a couple of threes now, so it doesn't matter that we weren't given any at the start. I think uh, newcomers to the game might panic if you see a digit missing, but um, as long as you can find some, uh, get some help from the other numbers, you're normally okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, six blocking down here and six across here puts six into either this square or this square. We're going to extend that across here like this and six blocking down here and six across there. So we know that that is going to be a six. Our 8 blocking down here gives us an 8 in that square. An 8 across here and here and down there means that that's going to be an 8. Two. Oh no, actually sorry. I made a mistake there. This is 9, sorry, blocking this square. We need a 9 in this row. That's going to be a 9, and this will be a 1. And the missing number here, 3. So 1 blocking down here and here and across there will give us 1 in that square. I was going to say the final digit 1, but it's obviously not, because there's another one that needs to be had over here. There we go. Ones are now out of the way, and the last number to place here is a four. Now, if you remember, I said five and seven block up here, five and seven block up here, so I know that these two squares can only contain five or seven, nothing else. Now we've got four blocking up here and four blocking across there, so that must be a four in that square. three blocks this square here. Now if you remember, this, these two squares can only be five and seven, nothing else. So three blocking this square means that that's going to be a three in this row. Now we have nine blocking up here and nine blocking across here. Do we care about these squares? No, we don't, because we know that's five and seven. So we know that's going to be a nine 
and the remaining squares like this have to be 2 and 6. Uh, can we get either of those? Yes, because we've got the 2 blocking across there. So there's the 2, and there is the 6. Then we have 6 across here, here, and up there. And that will be a 6. And 6 we can finish off by doing this. There we go. Uh, two blocks this square here, so this is our two, this is our three. Missing numbers here and here are two and eight, so this has to be three, four, nine. Any help? Yes, four and, oh, we've got nine blocking across here like this. So there's our nine, four blocking across here, there's our four, and this must be our three. two blocks this square here so this would be a two this has to be eight that must be eight and we have eight across here so there's our eight finished now and this would be a two and two across here and down and down there we go what's left to get threes um, we have three across here and down there which will give us three in that square and three going up here and there which means that's a three three across there threes are now finished the missing number here is five and we have five blocking across here which gives us five in that square five up there five across there there's our five and five back that way means this is a five the missing number here is seven seven blocking across here means that's a seven and seven down here means we get seven in that square and now we're just looking for four here four there that's it our medium level puzzle from the guardian over as i say don't know if i'll be able to get in any other games today what uh, probably not, but I will try. I will try. Bye-bye.